Hey stranger, long time no see. We are back, but this time we're not in the gym. Well, we are. We're in our gym. We're in our gym. Yay COVID-19. And after a lot of looking and searching, we were able to find enough equipment to be able to do our workouts here at home. The awesome part about this is we've had some major, major life events, haven't we, Dara? Oh yeah. Why don't you tell them? I'm pregnant. 27 weeks. Third trimester next week? Yeah. Since I've been pregnant, I've been following the Pregnant Athlete Program and we will be sure to link it in the description below. It's by a previous CrossFit athlete uh, named Brianna Battles, and um, then also she had some help by Heather. It's shown me a lot of different ways to modify exercises so I can still stay, stay active and healthy, um, but also still feel like I'm uh, making that progress and doing what's right for me and our little girl. And as a husband of a physically active woman, I love this program because it gives her something to do. It takes the stress off of me, for having to help her figure out what to do and she's really excelled with it uh, throughout this whole event. So what we're going to show you today is how I'm modifying some of the workout um, to still be able to do um, workouts with Eric, couples workouts like we've always done, um, but just modify them a little bit to take off the stress from my body. This week we are going to be doing a descending ladder workout and we are going to be doing deadlifts and burpees of all things. Welcome back, right? Uh, for this workout. I am going to do it uh, as prescribed. Dara is going to be scaling both movements and she's going to be scaling the rep scheme. Now if you're wondering what's a descending ladder workout, well essentially we're going to start at the high end of our reps and work our way down. So for this workout, for me, I will be doing 10 reps of deadlifts and then 10 bar over burpees. Once I complete that, I'll do nine, then I'll do eight, seven, six, so on until we finish. I'm gonna start at seven. So like male start at set, or excuse me, male start at 10 and female start at seven. So I'll start at seven with the same descending ladder and I'll do deadlifts as well, um, much lighter weight than normal, but then I'm gonna be doing a modified burpee for, to um, accommodate for my belly. <laughs> I used to do modified burpees for my belly too. Yeah. Different kind of belly. Yeah. Before we get started with our normal workout, we're going to show you those modifications. We've got some things we're going to do first before we get into the descending ladder workout, and we'll see you when we get there. Typically, a burpee is where you're going to kind of fall onto the ground. I usually bring my chest down to the ground for the burpee and then jump my feet forward and jump up into the air. Um, but instead, I'm just going to be modifying it by slowing everything down, putting my hands on the ground, walking each of my feet back separately, and watching, walking each of my feet back um, separately up, and then just standing up. So I have to take a wider stance to accommodate for my belly, um, and then not jumping so I don't create any unnecessary stress on my body and my pelvic floor. So it'll look like this.
us I'm colorblind All I know is we're here And they took us somewhere So what they say we're calling Falling out of line They don't know the two of us I'm colorblind, yeah was a really bad idea. You did drink milk. I did. <laughs> As you can see, this is an easy workout to scale. <laughs> oh, yeah. Figure out what weight range works best for you on the deadlift and just make those burpees happen. However, it has to be done. There's no shame in, no shame in scaling. Yeah. And I should have done that. Yeah. Ah, so. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this week. Uh, soon, we're gonna give you a tour of our huge gym <laughs> and maybe talk about some of the equipment we've got. So until then, like, share, subscribe. Appreciate your guys' support. We're excited to be back with more videos. Hey, don't forget, once we get 100 subscribers to our <laughs> YouTube channel, I get to eat, or have to eat, however, a dozen donuts. And I think my baby would really like eating a dozen donuts. Yeah. So subscribe, share with your friends, get them to subscribe, and then we'll make sure to video that. <laughs> see you guys. Did, Did you see the skank shaking? that was running across? Yes. <laughs> Don't call him that. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about a lizard, not my neighbor. I'm sorry, Mark. <laughs> Oh, there's the skink.